All right. We're going again. We're doing more things to it. More, more drift car things. Okay, since, since the last uh, video, I've done a couple of small things. Not, not big, just a couple of little things. Just different steering wheel. I don't know. Just thought I'd just give a deep, 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 deep wheel a go. See how it is. Got a little M lip, M sport lip. I just slapped it on there. It's not properly on there. But, you know, thought I'd give that a go. I might give it a little more aggression to the back because it's a bit... Usually all you can see is just like brown underbody, but... Um, what else? I washed it. If you wash my shorts, I washed it with a concrete cleaner, but it did pretty well. That's probably the first time I've ever seen like the windows shine. Like, it's been not bad. This one, okay, so today we have some goodies for it. Spaces. I kind of messed up and bought slip ons. So they just slip over and very long, long bolts. So I won't be able to stack them, unfortunately. But what I may end up doing is taking the fronts off because they're adapters, 5x114 adapters, put them on the back and then just run like them on the front because they don't need spaces or anything and then run some like, because I've got heaps of decent sized um, 5x114 like Nissan wheels and stuff. So maybe I'll do that. I might toss that up. All right, 25 mil spacer. Oops. <laughs> Didn't mean to drop it that fast. Hello. All right. 25 mil spacer is not enough. I reckon if we stacked another one, it'd be mint. Like 50 mils would be good for these wheels anyway. But yeah, I don't. I don't think that's gonna work. So let's try and. Don't mind that. Um, all right, I brought out the big dogs. That's an 18 by 10 plus like zero or something like, that's right on the lip. Look at that. That, I love that, but that kind of sucks because 18 by 10 is a really big wheel and uh, that's expensive. And that's no spaces on this side. Uh, so yeah, 17 in the front, 18 in the back. What do you reckon, folks? Whew. It looks fat in the back. Like, yeah. All right, I am going to show you all how these, uh, I adjust the, uh, Make these this wide body panel adjustable. Take some nuts out. Oh, there we go. There's two nuts. Ah. And then I'm gonna put them on the other side. Tighten them back up. Now, lower this now. Is a lot closer. The rim is a lot closer to the guard. Because we took out about 20, 20 mil of spaces, so that looks a lot better. Still, not quite what I want though. I want. Here we go. So now I have all right fitment. All right. While I'm doing the other side. I'm also going to be doing something else. Don't mind the uh, head torch, it's very useful. Yes, probably makes me look a bit silly, but bam, I can see everything. All right, so since this new one, new dual caliper setup, whatever, it was, the last line was hitting up against this, this trailing arm. So 
I've replaced the end with a banjo fitting. So I'm gonna slap that on there and I'll have to bleed it up. That's for the hydro and then yeah, should be mean. All right, just like that. That focuses right there. Hopefully that, oh, that's nice and solid there. I might zip tight to the camber arm, but hopefully it's good. All right, a couple things. Almost just died twice then, ow. All right, this side's been done. I adjusted the, uh, let me just get my head torch as a torch. Adjusted this panel, put the spaces on that side. Also got the caliper hooked up and kind of bled. Like I just, um, I've got pressure somehow. I just kind of left it open and then pushed this and that doesn't, that, that might, that might even be good. I'll probably still. Put that lip on, a bit better. Tech screwed it up, it's not going anywhere. Same with this, uh, this side of the bumper that was hanging down and now that's very much attached now. All right, so next day I have started pulling apart a couple of things. Tail lights off, fenders are off, front bumper, nose cone, headlights, indicators, both sides. Because we are going to put a bit of clear coat over it. I'm gonna leave it, I'm not gonna repaint it because I've grown quite fond of the yellow and purple but I'm just gonna make it look a little bit nicer with a bit of clear coat. And I have heaps of clear coat sitting around, so I'm gonna use it. All right, another update. Dog just took a whizzer. Car is fully taped up. It's been method. We've done a couple touch-ups here and there, mostly on the bonnet, a bit more on the roof, especially the bumper. But yeah, just a couple touch-ups here and there before we put clear coat on it. So we've also, Scuffed up these new fenders, well, new to me fenders, the less mounted than mild ones, but done the trick where you paint the trim black, like over here, so then it looks like it's got a trim on it, but it doesn't actually. He's already caught oh, runs in the paint. That was not me. Look that was it's quick. so bad. Taking, Look at it, bro. I've taken it off. Oh my goodness, how did you even manage that? How did you actually. Fuck off, you idiot. <laughs> oh, was that you? <laughs> no. Steven, he's got the can. Oh my goodness. All right, show me your fingers, show me your fingertips. Oh, they're not. They're not. Uh, oh, yeah, you see that? No, no. I was going to say oh. show car next, but I guess not. <laughs> Look at this man's fucking paint job. Look at it. Look at all the runs that he's done. Oh my god. Jeez. Can't have nice things around here with Alice, though. Bloody hell. Yeah, look at that one right there, that run. Bloody runs down here, everything. Wasn't bad as always. That, that is yours, man. Look at that. I haven't touched this at all. My car, but yours. <laughs> your run. <laughs> you give me the run, man. You've been having talk about that, haven't you? No. Yeah, look at that. That's, that's you. That wasn't it, yeah. yeah. That's not as bad. Okay, we seem to have um, gotten the part. Maybe. Um, the part where I have to move the car, even though I've taped it up. So. <sighs> okay. Yep. Yep. Oh, my back. I think I broke my back. Yep. Oh, yep. The fuel. Smack me in the head. Oh, do you say keys? This thing doesn't have keys. Oh, okay. Now. Yeah. Oh, yes. Z heaps. That's alright. Matt will guide me, hopefully. Alright. A bit of a change of plans. They didn't have the colour I wanted at uh, Bunnings, so we uh, chose to improvise. And a couple of these bad boys. Two cans, two of us. We're gonna need one of these. The cap. Did you want to build them up? Build them up? No. Shake them up? Sure. Straight onto the camera. No. <laughs> they didn't have the yellow bunnies. But these were the hair. I didn't want to do this, but... I did. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's time for a bit of a change. What, a, what about the BMW logo? <laughs> what about it? It's going to be black. You're blacking it out. Alright, we're blacking it out. Look at your P-30 green. Yeah, you go first. Oh my god. 
God, it's tank spoiler. The wheels. <laughs> oh, I, I, I made the mess so, oh, so quickly. Oh, jeez. Okay. Update. We are clear coating it tonight and it's getting awfully late. Pulled out the hardener to add to the clear coat and it hardened. It has been hardened. So we've got it all set up though. We uh, Our neighbour came in clutch with the, uh, the clear coat. You got heaps of it. So I'm mixing up a bottle of piss <laughs> and we'll get this done. We'll, we'll figure it out. You got it? Oh, it's sticky. Light. I can't tell if that's I feel like that's just air. No, it's not. Is it? So we've progressed into spraying clear. The single chloride. Not bad, considering we're using the wrong thinners. But I don't know if you can see that. Got a bit of our toilet dropping because the guns are set up wrong, courtesy of Alistair. I don't know what I'm doing either, so just blaming him. Besides that, it's not bad, it's shiny. Like, this is insanely shiny. Like, you can see me. I mean, mine, the pit holes. But, yeah, it's not bad. <laughs> yeah, that, that, um. That, don't don't that, break the can. The, the lid's stuck to the. <laughs> <laughs> I did say it was old shit. Did you buy this when you were a boy? <laughs> <laughs> You're putting hardener in that, aren't you? So it's a quarter that, of... That's, that's clear. Yeah, so 500 of the clear, 250 of the hardener, yeah. and then a, a, pinch, a pinch of... Uh, thing, right? Thinners. This is how you learnt, yeah? <laughs> no, I was a apprentice for mate. I worked nights as a panel beater so I could eat. Oh, jeez. So I got worked as a TA and then learnt to panel beat and paint mm. at nights because you yeah, didn't earn enough money to pay the bills. Yeah. So you probably want about that much thing. Right, so I'm going to say about 50 No, mil. no, no, it's that much. <laughs> <laughs> oh, awesome. Don't get all fucking technical now. Whoa! <laughs> I think we're past that point of being. Yeah? No, more. A bit more. There. And best thing, you got to stir it? Yeah, in here. You got a spoon? Nope. I That's not going to work. Oh, you watch it work. Yeah, no, no, no. <laughs> Give me my thinner spoon. Because <laughs> all you're doing is having liars still, you pour it in, it's still virus. But this is shaking you got, it up, you got a dirty stick. Yeah. Dirty stick. We'll find... Really? Don't think this is shaking. You pull, pull the bubbles. Well, what are you going to get? Bubbles? <laughs> That's a stick. Oh, there we go, yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, beautiful. You get the reaction, it's a chemical right. reaction. Oh. Alright, it is very much night time now. Mad rush to get that that like clear coat on, but we got it on and boy, oof, sheesh, she looks good. Fenders came off all right. It's still wet. Cause it started raining, so we had to like mang it inside. But oh my goodness, a little bit of clear coat goes a long way on the chromies. I, I'm sure the light's not doing it justice or the camera, but still like. I'm pretty happy about like the purple, like the clear coat on the purple, like that came up pretty good. But yeah, alright, we might... Whoa. I almost died. Alright, we might chuck the fenders on just to... Just to get a full body shot, you know.
All right, it's been a couple of days, but I've been flat out like a lizard, of course. Well, I haven't really had time, but last night I was able to put the car back together and what damn, she looks pretty good. Not bad for a rattle can and some a cheeky clear coat job, but at night, you know, came out pretty good. Love the purple. But not bad. Definitely could give it a like a a wet sand and polish to make it shine a bit better, but it's a drift car. I'll probably repaint it anyway. Yeah, I'm pretty happy with that. I still need to roll the guards. And, um, I need grills. That'd help. Yeah, I'm pretty happy with that. Not bad.